Hey guys, in this video, I want to show you how I 3D printed a grip for my Nintendo DS Lite. I've been looking for a grip for my DS Lite for a while now, and I haven't been able to track one down. I wanted one of those stereo grips, but they're very hard to come by. So I found that someone had designed a grip for the Nintendo 3DS on Thingiverse. I'll leave a link to the original designer's Thingiverse page. Since the 3DS and the DS Lite are roughly the same size, I only had to resize it slightly so that it would fit. The grip comes in two pieces so it's easier to print. I resized it to 102% on the X axis and 107 on the Z axis for the top piece. For the bottom piece, I only resized the X axis by 102%. I printed it out on my DaVinci 1.0 with uh, ABS filament at 0.4 layer height and it took about 3 hours to print both pieces. They actually came out pretty good. If you want a smoother finish, print it at a higher quality like 0.1 layer height. I might do that for the next print since this was more of a test. The next thing I had to do was glue the two pieces together. I used JB Weld which is a really strong epoxy, but you can use super glue, crazy glue, or acetone to fuse them together. Mix equal parts from the JB Weld uh, to create a gray paste and then spread it evenly on the top piece. Then I sandwiched the two pieces together and used some elastics to hold it in place while it dries. I glued the two small extra pieces that will help grip the DS light onto the, um, the actual handle in place by using some acetone. Acetone melts ABS and it fuses it pretty good together. So for small pieces like this, I like to use acetone. After the two pieces are glued together and dried, you can sand it and maybe paint it to hide the 3D uh, printed layers. I like the rough 3D look since it provides more grip, so I'll probably keep it this way. Anyway, that's it for this video. Links to everything I've showed you should be in the description. Comment, like, share, or subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.